Welcome again viewers, we are in the Panorama Apartments in Porto del Carmen, Lanzarote. This is room 100, there is one tiny issue in this room and I'll show you it in a wee second. Um, it's quite a nice room actually. I've also got breakfast booked in this hotel. At the end of this video I'll leave a wee link or I'll actually include the breakfast. I don't even know what kind of breakfast I've booked here. Um, I'll tell you how much I paid for it, let me know what you think. Spoiler alert, the one issue is behind that curtain there. We'll check that out in a wee second, okay? <laughs> um, TV, pretty high up the TV, isn't it? I really like this room. Uh, they've refurbished, I think, this, these apartments. I'm not really that keen on the location. If I remember at the end, I'll leave a link to another video showing you exactly where they're located. They're across from the Lomo Blanco, the ones I stayed in before. Um, so a wee bit of hilly location, but pretty decent room I'd say. So a studio room, and uh, we've got sockets at the side, full length mirror, desk obviously if I want to work on there as well. Another little desk there as well, funny enough. I booked this through Agoda, I think. It was the cheapest apartment I could find in Porto do Carmen tonight. And um, I don't think it's too bad a deal for the money. Storage space, that's absolutely fine. Safe as well. I actually arrived here at 12 o'clock, not expecting the room to be ready and just to leave my bag, but the room was ready, so that was pretty good. Everything you need. Uh, fridge, has it got anything in it? I doubt it. Uh, no water, point off, no water in the fridge. Is that a kettle or is that a coffee maker? I don't know. Um, MD wants to buy a portable charger, I'm going to recommend this one. You get it on Amazon and all the leads are included, so you don't have to bring out separate leads. It's got iPhone leads, Samsung, I can't remember the name of it, but it's like 17 quid. Just look for it, I carry it about with me everywhere. Um, you turn it on, it tells you how much percentage you've got left. 100%, look at that, that's unusual. 100%. Pound glasses there as well. Right, let me show you the bathroom. Bathroom's pretty nice as well. Got some toiletries here as well, like shampoo, conditioner, I think, shower gel. So you can see this has been recently renovated. It's really quite decent. So definitely a decent room. Hair dryer as well, pretty good. Another plug socket in the bathroom as well, that's pretty handy. But let's check out the one issue the room has got. This is what a class of one nighter room. They give this room to the people like me staying one night because if you're staying here a fortnight, you'd maybe complain about the outside balcony. Wait till you see it, it's tiny, wait till you see it. Um, paid 65 pounds for this. Oh, let's head out. 65 pounds, bed and breakfast. I think that's too bad. It's not, bottle of the camera's not that cheap, so that's not too bad. But this is the issue, really. Now, one thing I will say, you've sort of got a bit of privacy here. It's tiny, but don't know if you're getting any of the sun because this big tree in front of you is really windy to the enemy, so I'm not really worried about the sun. But it's not the best, is it? Nobody next to you, mind you. You've no neighbours. You have got the kind of main road outside. Let me see if I can go up the chair and show you a wee bit. Look at this, you could argue I've got a sea view up the top, not really, but I think that's the road down to the main strip. About two or three minute walk down to the main strip, you come out of Lineker's Bar around the corner and then you just go down the steps. You come out of Lineker's Bar, but um, the way back up, it's a lot of steps the way back up, and at night it's very poorly lit the way back up that way. So there's another way you can go. Let me get down here without killing myself, hold on. Oh, just about made it. So the room is great, apart from the balcony, terrace kind of lets it down. That's why I'm saying it's a one-nighter room. Um, we'll see what the breakfast is like, I'll include that obviously at the end of the video as well. Don't forget to hit the wee subscribe button, it's absolutely free, what do you think? I think I've been harsh here, I think the room's smashing. Um, one of the nicer rooms I've stayed in in Porto do Carmen, I'd say. Uh, reception staff are really nice. Also, I forgot to tell you this. Also, uh, they've got a shower room, so if you're on a late flight, you can book the shower room as well. They've got a wee gym, they've got a pool bar, 
and they've got a wee restaurant as well. So quite a nice complex I actually think. Um, I've, I've heard the pool's pretty cold, I've not checked the pool yet. I'll do a video walking down from the pool and I'll let you know what I thought. Um, but a wee bit of a shame about the balcony, it won't bother me, I'm only here one night, but it'd maybe bother you if you're staying here a week or two weeks. That's not the best balcony, is it? There's definitely a lot better ones overlooking the pool and everything. So you might want to request that or pay a wee bit extra if you've got the option for upgrading the room. Let me show you the breakfast. Let's go. Breakfast selection of the <laughs> Panorama. It's pretty decent. This is included in the price. Most self-catering, you don't get it. You get coffee or an orange juice included as well. It's on to 11 o'clock, but look at your wee setting here, lovely wee bit. Orange juice, really cold with ice in it, can't complain. Okay, the wee mini breakfast has arrived, and effectively this is included the price, I take it, it's kind of free. So can't really complain, don't know what it's going to be like, but no complaints at all. Quite like these apartments. Um, pool has got quite a good vibe, I don't know how warm it is, I've not been in it. It's been a bit windy today, so I'll go out there later on. But uh, yeah, I've enjoyed my stay at these apartments. Um, Location-wise, it's not brilliant, a wee bit hilly, but would I stay here again? Yeah, I probably would. This is also part of the breakfast selection as well, so I really cannot complain. A wee bonus, a wee cake there, it's nice. Well, breakfast was decent, just waiting on my flight about an hour. The other rooms that you want, really. Over there, I think the rain's just come on, it's spitting. The weather's been pretty bad. Uh, yeah, you want a wee pool view room? That's better than the room I'm in, definitely for sure. 